Hola amigos. So today we are going to do a guide on how to set up Netplay, in particularly for my Scott Pilgrim vs. Full Game in Eichmann Go. Now the first thing you need is an application called Radmin VPN. If you Google it, you will find it very easily. You just download it and install. Believe it or not, I don't remember offhand if you have to make an account with Radmin, but if you do, it doesn't take long and it's nothing crazy. Once you load up Radmin, uh, you look, it looks like this. This is your virtual IP, and this is what you're going to give people so they can log into the same network as you. Once you're on the same network, then you can begin playing. Um, if I go to system, I could change my name to whatever I want it to be. I could also do some other settings, which I've personally never messed with any of the settings here, other than whatever I needed for my login account. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to join the Scott Pilgrim vs. Uh, Radman channel. I'm going to our Discord in the Netplay setup, the Radman server is literally Scott Pilgrim vs. I'm going to copy this into join network. Scott Pilgrim vs. The password is Scott is the best. Scott is best. I'll paste it here just so it's easier and join. When I've joined successfully, these are all the people from the Discord who are online, notice the green bars, and ready to play. So today, I'm going to do an example run of playing online against Leroy. Also, make sure you download the latest version of Scott Pilgrim vs. from the download links tab at the top. This one will always be the most updated version. I didn't change the number, but that does include these last updates. Okay, so now let me get in contact with Leroy and we will begin our online fight. So this is Leroy. Hello. <laughs> He's gonna be helping with the demonstration. So uh, Leroy, if you can be so kind as to host, that'd be amazing. Will do. I'd like. Okay. Get Radman open. Yes. Thank you. Let me just lower Scott down because Scott's a loud game. Oh, it is. All right. So the important thing to do when you are playing someone in Netplay, basically all of you join one server and then everyone's assigned an IP. Um, this is my IP here and this is Leroy's IP here. If I want to join yeah. his game, he has to host, which he is. Answering. Answering. I go to Netplay. I go to join game. I have to enter his name, which I can name it whatever I want to name him. But to be nice, I'll name him Leroy. Oh, Next, it's asking me for an IP. So now I input this number uh, 26.22.25.183. And as soon as I press enter, it's going to take us to the Netplay menu. If your screen hangs on the connecting uh, screen, it's not going to work. It should never hang on the connecting screen. As soon as I press enter, it goes, well, as soon as I press enter on Leroy's name, it goes straight to this screen. Um, Leroy, uh, I'm going to exit it for a second. Okay. Don't host yet. I just want to show them what that screen looks like. So if you see now connecting to whoever's name and then the uh, Radman IP and it hangs like this, it's not going to connect. Something's horribly wrong. Most likely that person has a VPN. In my case, I have a uh, private internet access and it will not let me connect to a lot of people because Radman's also a VPN. So I'm not sure what the issue is, but that's why that doesn't work. Uh, go ahead, Leroy, you can host again. Okay, and 
I'm going to connect to him. And there we go. Now we can pick the mode we want to play. We're going to do versus. And a single match. And there he is. In all his glory. Wow. Okay. Matthew Patel. <laughs> And for the record, this is a live match. It's not scripted. He is cheating. Yeah. Just because he's Matthew. Indeed. Oh, I'm not good. <laughs> oh, come on. In regards to lag, it's relative to the people you're playing. Sometimes you get no lag whatsoever. Sometimes you get a lot of lag. There's no proper fix for it. It's all location based. Leroy, if I'm correct, you're in the Americas? There we go. Yeah, he's concentrating on cheating. Uh, anyways. Yep. <laughs> for us, we're all both in them. America, so it's very easy for us to connect to each other. Um, outside yeah. of that, who knows how good or bad it'll be. But it's pretty good as you can see. Good enough for me to block Die, that. bastard. Damn. Oh, he's just gone. I thought he was going to do something. I know, it's a two. <laughs> thought he was going to pop up the screen. Oh my gosh. I love Ooh. how Negus got nut punches you. <laughs> it's the funniest thing to me. Oh, I'm gone. Oh, no. Oh, no. I gotta add command buffering. It makes um... it a lot easier. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Oh, why did that work that time? I don't know. <laughs> no. You bastard. Oh. No. I can't. no. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> Hopefully, but okay. Sucker. I think you get grab after uh, on that. That's right. Forget the strikers in the game. Uh, as uh, even though I made it, I forgot there's strikers in the game. As Mega soon as knives. Strikers are hittable. They will be. be except knife. Mega knives. I feel that. I'm okay with that. Am I cheating? Yes, I am. Oh my god, no! Ow. All my... All my efforts thwarted. Die. <laughs> <laughs> no. She's like the one striker that turns around. She's scary. She is. All right, Leroy, I'll take my victory and leave. Uh -huh. So that pretty much ends the guide on how to blue net play. And you should definitely check out the Scott Pilgrim versus Discord. And join us. Indeed, we're nice. Nice. <laughs> More updates to come. Thank you for joining, and thank you, Leroy, for assisting. Welcome. Deuces. Deuces.